So if you're one of those that want to unlock all the cool skins that Black Ops 4 offers but you are having a hard time getting through the headshot challenges, I will show you the right and fastest way to get through these challenges in one setting. Tip number one, always keep your cursor in the middle. When encountering an opponent, you don't want them to catch you with your pants down, in other words, with your cursor aiming down the floor because you will more than likely end up falling on your face. In other words, dead. Even when jumping it is a good idea to always keep it in the middle this helps with pre-aim and helps you gain an advantage on the opponent when you quickly have to start hit firing due to the speed at which he appeared tip numero dos as soon as you start shooting if the cursor isn't already on their head slowly move your right stick up until it hits the head i do this countless of times and it gets me a headshot 90 percent of the time even when hit firing and tip number three straff 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 left and right you can slowly move your stick up while you are strafing to get that sick headshot it can take you a while to get the hang of it but hey practice makes perfect now all these three tips in a nutshell basically whenever you start shooting if you maintain your cursor in the middle and you start shooting always try to move your aim up as you shoot which will eventually end up hitting the head which obviously will give you a headshot trust me this works I unlocked all all of my headshot challenges in one sitting because I just kept getting headshot left and right. Now I will leave you guys with the remainder of this video with some great gameplay that I had while I was recording this for you. If you like shooting games like Black Ops, Battlefield, and Battle Royale just like me, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe, and hit that naughty bell so you won't miss out on any of these tips and tricks that will help you slay your opponent. This was Jay with Elite Games, game on.